Check it out, guys. All right, so this is my messed up ankle. It's kind of hard to see here, but I've had two major surgeries there, two major surgeries there. That's the most recent one. They cut into one there, back there. Got a couple happy, uh, happy scars right there too. So, I don't know if you can really see me too well here. We'll see. Um, so that's the leg that we're considering removing. Like I said, it hurts pretty much all the time, every day, and it will like click and pop and hurt like hell out of nowhere. And I spend every night icing it and I can't really walk. Um, so I just wanted to show it to you guys before we kind of go any further and maybe just have visual record that it existed if I do go ahead and remove it, which is a weird thing to be saying. And I'm pretty sure I'll probably get comments that I shouldn't do this, but, or maybe not. Maybe um, people will understand it and get it, but we'll see. Um, but yeah, that's, uh, that's my leg. And I don't actually remember how many surgeries I've had on it. I should have kept count. We actually did at one point, we used to write down the dates of um, every surgery that I'd had on this massive pair of uh, scrubs that someone gave me when I was leaving the hospital. They were like a size extra, extra, extra large. And we used to write down the date of every surgery or procedure I had, but then they burned in a house fire that happened when I was 16. So I lost all those dates and then I changed doctors so many times. Um, but I think it's been around 10. I think it's been about 10 and different injections and stuff in there as well. Um, so yeah, at this point I'm thinking it's probably best given the information and life I'm living right now to go ahead with a lower leg amputation. But we'll see. Um, we'll find out soon. Thanks, guys.